Hey, hey, hey! Welcome back to PCF Academy with Andrew Butenko. And today I will talk about ways you can use to make the size of components smaller. Tip number one. Use only what is needed in your PCF component. Let me use the code of this component as an example. As you can see, I use primary button and stack controls from the Fluent UI framework. To use these controls, I use the import statement where I reference Fluent UI React and this operation blows up the size of components code. Let me build the project to demonstrate the size of the bundle.js file that contains all of the components code. I use npm run script build command to build the project. As you can see, the size of the bundle.js file is more than 5 MB. Let's fix it. To do it, I change import statements to reference files that contain specific controls I used in the code of the PCF component. Let me rebuild the project after changes have been applied. As you can see, file became two times smaller comparing to the initial size. Tip number two. Use production mode whenever a component is deployed to the CDS. In this case, bundle.js is minified. There are a few ways developers can use to set deployment mode to production. I will leave the URL to the article that describes all available options under this video. I use pack pcf push command to deploy components to CDS and here are steps to set deployment mode to production in this instance. Open pcf proj file and look for property group tag where the first node contains the name of your project. Add pcf build mode node with production value in it. Save and close the file. To push change to CDS, execute pack pcf push command. Let's check the size of the bundle.js file after this modification. Now the size is around 300 kilobytes. Comparing to the initial state, bundle.js became almost 15 times smaller. Thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a like and post a comment if you have one. See you the next time.